Hello. In tutorial one, I showed you some of the most basic ukulele strokes. So the first thing we started off with was with the down stroke, where you use the nail of the finger and you do a down strum on the beat. So it would just be like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then we progressed and we learned what's called the ordinary stroke or the common stroke. And when you do that, you still have that down stroke on the beat, but in between, you do an up stroke and you use the fleshy part of the finger on the up stroke. So that would sound like this. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And I would recommend that to begin with, you really make sure you've mastered those two things, doing the basic down or doing the the common stroke of the, the down and up throughout a piece. But when you feel ready to move on, the next thing we would normally do is to try and do a combination of those two things. So you might, for example, put just a down on the first beat, on beat number one, but then you might do your down and up on the subsequent beats on two, three and four. And that would sound like this. One, two, three, four. demonstration I'm just using a C chord just so that I can concentrate on what I'm doing with my with my strumming patterns so that's one combination another combination we find really useful is to do a down on the first and third beat but on the second and fourth we do the down up and then you get this effect one two three four one two three four join in with that have a go moving on from that is take the tunes and the songs that you already know and have a go at trying these new strum patterns. Um, so it's not as if one strum pattern is the correct pattern to use for any song. Just experiment and see what, what you feel works works best for, for the strum patterns um, that, you, that you're learning. Um, I can give you a couple of, of recommendations. So our Smile Time song number two is Save the Last Dance for Me. Um, and a strum pattern that you might like to try with that is the first one I showed you where you have the down and then the beats two, three and four were the down and up. So you, you would get something like this. You can dance. gives a nice little push on that first beat. Doing just the single down gives that little bit of an emphasis to the first beat. Another one you might like to try, um, our Smile Time song number 12 is Enjoy Yourself. And that works really well with, with that other pattern, the, um, the down, down, up, down, down, up. So, enjoy. nice rocking feel to do that to do that strum pattern. Um, so the main thing is just try and gradually progress your strum patterns um, but don't go, try and go too fast make sure you're nice and confident because what you need to do is get to the point where it's just flowing and you're not having to think too hard about it so that you feel quite natural about how you how you're doing your strumming. Um, so have a go now go and practice all the songs that you like but try these new strum patterns. Bye bye for today.